Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Today we're going to limit what data gets sent back to Microsoft. When you have your operating system installed, it automatically sends data to them. We cannot prevent them from totally sending data to them, except getting totally offline, what makes no sense. But we can limit it at least what data they get. First, I usually don't use a Microsoft account to sign into my computer. I use a local account, but I'm not getting into this today. The first thing you should do if you haven't done it when you installed the operating system is go to privacy and security, hit your Windows key and I, go to privacy and security, go to general, expand general, and turn all that stuff off. Now go back to Find My Device. Click on Find My Device. And if you didn't disable it, disable your location settings. If you have a PC and not a laptop, it makes no sense anyway for the location because you are not carrying around your desktop. Inking and typing. I turn this also off. Diagnostic data and feedback. We set this to off. Tailored experience off. Delete diagnostic data. Now let's go further and disable telemetry. Like always with the Windows operating system, you have different options to accomplish the same task. So let's get started. First, I start with the easiest option through services and yes i'm in windows 11 here but i'm gonna switch to windows 10 if there is a difference in how to disable the settings so hit your windows key and type services open the services app i run it as administrator now we go to connected user experience and telemetry double click on the service Disable the service, we stop it and set it to disable. Apply, OK. The next service we disable. Next, we go to device management wireless application protocol. Push message routing service. Double click on it. It starts manual. We set it to disabled and apply OK. The next option we have, we can stop it through Group Policy Editor. Now open the Policy Editor by clicking again on your Windows icon or hit your Windows button on the keyboard. Type GP Edit. Now let's maximize this so we all see what we are doing here. Go to administrative tem templates, Windows components, data collection and preview builds, and here you see allow diagnostic data. We set this to disabled. Now in Windows 10, it will look a little bit different. We also go to GP Edit. Administrative Templates, Windows Components, Data Collection and Preview Builds. And it says allow telemetry. Double click it, set it to disabled, apply, OK. Now we have another option where we can disable it, and that's in your registry editor. You click on your Windows icon and type rec edit. 
and you get to your registry editor. I run it as an administrator. Now we have to insert a new D word in our registry key. For that, we go to H key local machine. software, policies, Microsoft, Windows, and you see data collection. In here we create a new D word. So you right click in that free space new and select D word 32 bit. You name this allow telemetry. Double click it, insert the value as zero and click OK. Once you're done with that, restart the system. And the last option I show you disabling telemetry is through the task scheduler. Expand the library. Microsoft. Windows. Customer Experience Improvement Program. Now disable all of these tasks by right clicking on it and disable them. There are a lot more privacy options you could apply, but at least we limited the operating system to send out a whole bunch of data to Microsoft. Thank you for watching my video. Please give this video a thumbs up. It really helps the channel out. And if you're not a subscriber, please consider subscribing to my channel. Thank you so much, and you all have a great week.